Dear viewers, today I have brought a video in front of you regarding measurement of current of a circuit by using ammeter selected switch. Please watch the video. Direct measurement of current is possible when current is very low and working voltage is also low and safe to handle. But when we measure high current of any circuit and at high working voltage, it is impossible to measure such current directly. Then we use current transformer CT which steps down high current to a suitable measurable current and handling of such current is also easy. Here we have used in the picture a round type CT of single core through which current carrying bus has been inserted and the bus act as primary of the city. S1 and S2, the secondary terminal of the city, connected with an emitter of suitable range and ratings. This is the pointer which will move along this dial. During movement, the pointer will stand at or near a scale division which will be the reading of the meter of a certain load. For single phase measurement, single city and single emitter is used. To get actual reading of emitter, the reading of meter is multiple by a factor known as multiple factor. The CT has specific ratio. The CT ratio here 100 by 5 ampere means if primary side current is 100 ampere then secondary side current will be 5 ampere. Meter has also incorporated with a city within its own circuit is known as meter city. It has also a city ratio. Every ammeter is marked with a meter city ratio. Here city ratio is 100 by 5 ampere. Multiple factor is equal to city ratio by meter city ratio. Here multiple factor is 1. The reading of the meter is to be multiplied by multiple factor to get actual reading. To measure three phase current the zone arrangement is to be followed. Three city and three ammeter required for three phase current measurement.
by using an ampere selected switch three phase reading can be obtained by a single ammeter ass ampere selected switch is a special type of rotary switch through which other two connections of city secondaries become sorted at the switch with neutral when current of one is being measured by rotation of knob of the selected switch so that secondary of any city not becomes open circuited as during operation open circuited secondary may damage the city connected equipment and may be dangerous to operator in electrical panel boards mostly an ampere selector switch is installed in a single phase system we need only one ammeter with a current transformer to meter the total load in amperes but in a three phase system for metering amperes for each line we need three ammeter and three current transformer but in the electrical panel board we can do this with only one ammeter or ampere meter by using the ammeter selector switch simply speaking in order to reduce the number of ammeters an ammeter selector switch can be used current transformer should be placed on each line and the secondaries of the current transformers are connected to the ampere selector switch This is a picture of LH3x3 drive ammeter selector switch. The contact and con contact positions are shown here. Please watch carefully.